Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another NHL 22 hut video. We're going to be getting into the top three R-Star cards to invest in from each division before the R-Star game and competition this weekend. So make sure to stay tuned, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for more content. So getting into it, if this is your first All-Star event in a hut, we're going to be getting into just a set of rules here. So two attributes will boost to a 99 for each uh, skills competition winner, plus one overall for every goal scored in the All-Star game, plus four overall for every two goalies on the final winning team. An All-Star uh, game MVP will boost to a 90, 95 overall, and all players from uh, the winning team will be award awarded an additional synergy slot. So if you don't know how the yeah, All-Star game works, obviously it's very high scoring. So I'm just going to be picking the three top players that I think uh, are going to win the competition or get the most goals. The top three cards I have in the Pacific Division is McDavid, Dreisaitl, and Thibaut Meyer. Um, obviously not a surprise with uh, McDavid and Dreisaitl. I think McDavid will at least win the fastest skater and uh, or at least get some goals in the All-Star game. Obviously same with Dreisaitl. And uh, Meyer has been absolutely having himself a really good season. And he's got some pretty good uh, synergies here too. I think he's going to get a couple goals. He's in, I think he's in the hardest slap shot competition. I'm not too sure if he's going to win that. But I do think he's going to get a couple goals in the All-Star game. He has been, he's been playing great. So I definitely think that his overall will be going up. My top three players for the Central Division are Nazem Kadri, Makar, and Kyra Connor. All three of them have been having a pretty good season, especially Kadri. Absolutely insane for Colorado. I think going to continue that over to the R Star game. Obviously, nothing's none of the cards are guaranteed because they're just you know it's R Star game, it's just for fun. You know they don't really compete that hard, but I do think that they're going to. Uh, yeah, they're going to get some goals. Obviously, again, it's high scoring. So I think, uh, you know, Kadri, maybe two, three goals. Um, Makar, at least a couple. You know, Connor, too. Um, so I think they're all going to do pretty good. I'm also not going too in-depth on the stats because they're all kind of the same. We're just taking a quick look here. Makar, this is going to be a great card if he does get upgraded, which I'm sure he, uh, he will. 93 speed his shooting is really good already uh, his this card is really good um, 94 deking um, his hands are really good there the uh, synergies are decent looking at Kadri here his uh, synergies are good, uh, looking pretty good his speed is an 89 shooting there in the high uh, 80s his hands are in the low 90s Connor, he's got one on spark, a one on workhorse, one on buzzing and light the lamp. Pretty solid synergies. He's 6'182 pounds, really good. Uh, shooting is in the high 80s and low 90s. His speed is an 89. His hands are looking pretty good there in the mid range in 90s. Picks for the Metro Division are Adam Fox. But if one, if uh, one of the best defensemen in the game, if not the best. His synergies are booming shot, the gladiator, uh, buzzing, and spark. His speed is a 91. Shooting is pretty good in the high 80s. His hands are looking pretty good there too on the mid-range 90s. It's a very good card, and he is going to get even better if he does get the up, uh, upgrade, upgrade, which again, I'm sure he will, just like McCarr. Definitely going to be some of the best defensemen in the game here. So called Gensel here too in second. Um, he's got some decent synergies, some pretty good stats. Shooting is in the low 90s. Hands are pretty good. He's a pretty solid winger. Third spot, I have uh, Sebastian Aho. I think he's going to have a pretty good weekend. His synergies are fly the zone wingman and heart and soul and thief. 89 speed. Shooting is in the low 90s. Hands are pretty good. Um, this is getting a face off in 82, so you can't toss him at center. This is gonna be a pretty solid card um, if he does get the upgraded. If he does get upgraded, and it's already a pretty uh, good card. My top three cards for the Atlantic Division are Matthews, obviously gonna get a couple goals, gonna win a competition, and we got Huberto, obviously been playing really good uh, on Florida, probably the best team in the NHL right now. And Larkin has been having a very good season for Detroit. 
So Matthews, it obviously depends how much he gets upgraded because there is an X factor for his card. You know, same with all the others. Basically, McDavid, Dry, Seidel. So you just got to be careful of that. Um, but his card is going to be pretty good. Right now, it's 87 speed, so it's not not crazy. Um, but his shooting is looking pretty good. Hands there. His checking is, is not too bad. His defensive awareness is okay. Um... So yeah, I think obviously I think he's gonna get the upgrade. Huberto, I think I'm pretty sure he's in the face. I think there's a new competition going on. It's a face-off competition, something like that. I think he's gonna be. Uh, I think he's gonna do really good. Also, I think he's gonna get a couple goals for sure. This card is looking very good. He's got some decent synergies. Some pretty good synergies actually. His uh, shooting, his speed is an 89. His shooting is in the low 90s. Hands are in the low 90s. This is gonna be an excellent card if he does get upgraded. And we got the Larkin here. My third pick. Heart and soul, light the lamp. Well rounded and magician. Uh, decent synergies. 94 speed. Shooting is in the high nine, uh, high 80s. Uh, hands are in the low 90s. Great speed on this card. It's gonna go up even more if he does get upgraded. This is gonna be a really good card. Thanks for watching the video everyone if you guys did enjoy make sure to give the video a like hit that subscribe button to join the chill vibes Make sure to check out my Instagram the link is in the description I'm always posting all kinds of stuff on there and make sure you ring the bell to notify for every time I upload and it's been your boy chill vibes signing in and out peace